11 o'clock is Gumbo Radio. Yo, yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your girl, Maura Ash. Of course, the Gumbo Radio Show. We are here and we are live at Bliss Bar and Lounge. And I got my people with me, mm. my family, mm. my STL brother wow. is in the building, of yeah. course. I know him as Rucka Puff. Yeah. Y'all know him as Zeus Waters. Yeah. But I just wanted to jump in here and really quickly... Thank you, for one, for thinking of me when you decided to come out to Atlanta to put of this course. event on. Definitely. For br- bringing you. me in, for a- even thinking of me to, you know, collaborate with you to do this. Yeah, yeah. I want to ask you, how do you, as an artist, go so hard with your own personal career but still find the time, energy, and efforts to put so much into other artists? Because that's something that I noticed about you. You take a crew of artists with you everywhere you go. You're not yeah. the only person that gets shine. You are maybe the headliner, but you make sure that your people get their time, that yeah. they get recognized, that people know who they are. So how do you balance that? And how do you... Um, kind of wear the boss hat without it being like that because that's yeah. what I see but mm-hmm. I also see you can fall in with them as well yeah, yeah, yeah. so explain I'm a, to me I'm how that I'm going to carry the guitar works. and carry the equipment as well well I, 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 I would say that's two different things I feel like God gives everybody this special gift my special gift is being a multitasker so okay. you know what I'm saying having my, my children I was I learned how to send a text message send an email uh, 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 tell her to do her homework. Tell her to go clean up, Very wash true. dishes, Just still flip the steak. You know what I'm saying? Life. So, yeah, so one reason for me being able to just do my thing and still help others is because I'm a master at multitasking, okay? And then the other thing is I feel like it's you, you only bigger than the people that you help. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Very so true. I feel like it's super important to not only work on my craft and work on my career, but also inspire and help push others. You know what I'm saying? Because one of them could be the next. The next. Mm-hmm. And, you know what I'm saying? And then I got to jump into another position and be like, okay, Zeus, shit, you be my manager. All yeah. right, bet. Well, shit, we ain't got no egos. We trying to get to the bag. And Either way. As long as we doing what our passion yeah. is, I'll be the road manager. I'll be whatever if God say I'm not the artist. You know what yeah. I'm saying? But I think I am the artist. Hey, you better t- I'm going to say that huh? right now. What? You no, better tell him, okay? But no, for, for real though, yeah. So we come from a city that's very unique. Um, people hear about St. Louis. A lot of the things that they hear about St. Louis probably are not in a positive light. Yeah. But we've seen positivity we've seen lots of great things come from st louis which is why i believe we wear it so proudly you know what i mean um i see you as a person that does a lot for the community i know you and my cousin shell the barber shout out to shelly edge up experience you guys but i know y'all team up sometimes and y'all do stuff for the community for the football children for you know where do you find this time? Because I see you exercising. I see you giving back to the community. I see you managing. I see you performing. Yeah. I don't know what. I'm like, I'm doing too late. I'm already tired. So I'm trying no, to figure man, out what. You know, what? Just, we motivated. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, I just got right now, I'm in this, this stage in my life. And I feel like I've always been like this. But I just got a real go fight win mentality. You know what I'm saying? And I, I, I think. Oh, yeah, stay mm-hmm. hungry. You know what I'm saying? We got food, but we still hungry. Mm-hmm. And I just try to keep myself in that mentality. Um, I remember the first time I had bought, bought my new car, I bought me a Mercedes. And uh, maybe like, I say maybe a week later, people always seen me walking. And people be like, bro, like DMing me like, bro, why are you always walking, bro? And I'd be like, because shit, I can lose this motherfucking mm-hmm. car. You know what I'm saying? Anything can happen. So I always just try, try to... Humble do things to put myself back in check you know what i mean so you know what i mean i never lose because i'm always gonna be in grind mode you Mm -hmm. know what i mean so i just try to stay consistent and stay positive and you know stay pushing and also understand that what we're doing is not always about us you know what i'm saying it it only makes it more better if you know you teach some young girl that Mm want to do a podcast but Mm -hmm. she don't know how but you got all the you already Mm -hmm. got all the sauce so Mm -hmm. all you got to do is yeah, little mama, this all you got to do is boom, 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 boom. When you do that and she do something great, you that's a win. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? We have to, in our community, start looking at like that, that being like a win. Because everybody correct. else's community, they help each other. Yeah. And our community, we always like into this uh, competition. And You know what I'm saying? You and probably like not as much here. as my city, for sure. A little bit farther than yourself, yeah. I feel like it's what it is. It's the crab in the bucket mentality. There it is. Where people want it. They want to see you go, but they only want to see you go so far. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then once you get to that point where they feel like, are oh, you too far because I mm-hmm. can't get there. I can't yeah. catch up. That's when they try to pull yeah, you down. Or feel like that you could be a, a potential threat or something. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's enough out here for everybody. So I have two last things for him and we're going to close this out. Cool. One is, every time I interview Zeus, I have to let it be known that I officially 
I think I'm like your real fan because I met my husband at his show. <laughs> that is like literally, I never knew right. him. That's he was so performing, dope too. and we met at his show. So yeah. I just think that's, that's an crazy. interesting fun fact about you know our yeah. relationship. So I'm like, a, um, I'm like a part of the relationship. You are you like almost. a part of my marriage a little bit, low a little key. Bit. You know, we you weren't even supposed to be at that concert <laughs> over there. At, uh, where was we at on Broadway? Spotlight, at the said, spotlight. Right? yeah, spotlight. we weren't even supposed yeah. to be over Shout there. Shout out to Mr. Galloway. It was a Tuesday too. Supposed to be at work. Two dollar Tuesday. Two dollar Tuesday should be lit too. Two dollar Tuesday is fire. So look, we gonna close this out. Bit. Anybody that knows you, they know that you have a dance that you do. That's right. And every time I see you out in the city of St. Louis, you with everybody, making everybody do this dance. That's so right. I have to fall in line and okay. I need to do this dance with you. Okay. So I'm waiting for you to show me. Okay, here we go. Okay, you gotta show me first. How do I do it? So basically, So I just want to thank you for being here from St. Louis, for yeah. being a part of the Gumbo Radio Show. Y'all make sure y'all check us out every Thursday night on air. It hits 92.3 from 7 to 9 Eastern Time. Mm. Tell them how they can find you. Zeus Rebel Waters on all platforms. Z-E-U-S Rebel. R-E-B-E-L. Waters like the water you drink on every platform. We need to get love to a million streams. We had 100,000 that need your help. Hey. Help me. It's possible. Y'all know what it is, man. Your girl, more Ash, the Gumbo Team. Seven o'clock is Gumbo Radio.